man, what's going on, y'all? How y'all doing, man? Today is the 25th of February, 2021. All right, today, I had a little bit of, hold on, let me put this thing on. Matter of fact, I'm going to turn it off. All right, so today, like I said, it's the 25th of February, 2021. Day two of orientation at US Express, but I'm going on the LP side. I'm not a company driver. However, company drivers and the LP drivers, Variant, um, Swift, and there's another guy that's there that's a company driver, but he has Ryder on his, uh, on his, uh, Name black and not Swift uh, Transportation, but Swift Enterprise, something like that. It's it's a whole nother different company, but um, all of us go through the same orientation. All right. So what happened today was I got in there. Um, all I had to do was my road test, my e, e log, which is hours of service class and the uh, EAF. I don't know what EAF stands for cause there's no way in the paperwork what it stands for. It just says EAF on the paperwork. Um, so I'm gonna explain to you what the EAF is, right? The EAF is a test to test your muscles within your neck and your back, your arms, your leg. And it's designed to, I guess, read the electrical pulses that your muscles generate when they when they move right so the only people that do that test are drivers that actually touch freight so freight um accounts like the dollar general family dollar um dollar tree accounts that where the driver actually unloads the trailer himself or herself those are the ones that do that test everybody else otr guys or uh guys that on the walmart account dedicated other dedicated accounts that the driver does not do any unload they don't have to worry about that test uh that test is done in case we injure ourselves um if we do injure ourselves we'll do that same test again and they'll compare the second test from the first test and determine what steps do I need to take in order to recover as fast as possible? So that's why they do that test. Um, I know you see all this gut right here, man. But um, what we do is, um, so I did that today. And then I did my hours of service. Hours of service is a four hour class. It's a four hour class on how to use US Express's e-logs. U.S. Express made their own software for their e-logs. So the e-logs, it's the funct at the end of the day, the functions are the same, but at the same time, it's totally different. It's like comparing a Mac to a Windows PC. At the end of the day, they both do the same thing, but how you get to the same point is totally different. You see what I'm saying? So... Um, that's pretty much all I did today was my hours of service and my EAF. Tomorrow I got my road test and I get my phone call from um, the leasing guys at 930. And hopefully tomorrow I get my truck. I mean, we still waiting on the drug test to come back, but you know, I'm going to pass that. I don't do no drugs, so I'm good on that. Uh, other than that, the road test is all I got to do now. Road test, get my phone call from the uh, from the, the the leasing and get a truck and leave. That's what, that's all I got left. So like I said, today is the 25th of February, uh, 2021. So hey, that's how, that's orientation day number two for me. Appreciate y'all. Y'all have y'all self a good one.